What is going on, my fine folks of YouTube? This is MK The Truth, D-O-D-B-E-N-T. Got some upcoming 350s finally for us to look at today. If you guys are new to my channel, come on and join the family. Also, connect to my Instagram. It is the underscore truth underscore MK. Also, ladies and gentlemen, all music is produced by me, D-O-D-B. And we upload them here as well. But before we get started, my reviews are for educational purposes only. This is only MK's analysis. And then we get on up out of here. So we have an upcoming pair of 350s finally. Yeezy is back. We are badly in need of some competition because Nike was just going to ring our necks with anything they wanted. Anyway, 350 box. And today I have for you reversed Bell Uga. Reversed? <laughs> Reverse Beluga. Now, mm, 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 mm. man, these are hard, in my opinion. Woo wee! The Yeezy 350 Reversed Beluga. I like these, man. So, of course, we gotta put these next to the OG Beluga. It ain't really too much different. It is just a darker tone, something that Yeezy is known for doing, but I like it. It works. It works. So anyway, let's get this out of the way. We'll come back to that in a second. This is the upcoming reverse Bell Uga or Beluga. I like the Supply 350. I love that. I think that should stay. I like the plain ones too, but I kind of missed this one here. I also love the zebra style print that they have all over the shoe. If you didn't see, the laces are reflective. Yeah, you can see them kind of reflecting in there. Okay, very nice. Got the Yeezy on the inside, Yeezy and Adidas. Oh man, it's just sad what they're going through. But we need this. We need this competition. If we don't have this competition, it doesn't push Nike or well, it's just Nike and Adidas right now. It doesn't push Nike to do the great things that they're doing with collaborators. So I think Yeezy is very much needed and needs to stay here. Anyway, nothing too crazy going on. Like I said, it's pretty much the same as the other one, but I do like the darker hit of the sole where you can see a little bit more boost. Of course, you got the bursting uh, orange burst out on the medial side. Very good looking pair of shoes. The only thing I see reflective are the laces, and that's a very good look. So let's go ahead and closely compare these right quick to this one. And boom, you can see the other one is, wow, this one, oh no, it's, that's just the angle. <laughs> anyway, you can see these, this one has like the beluga gray. This is more beluga gray. Beluga is a, like a whale, it's like a gray whale, I believe. And this is more in line with like a uh, beluga, the gray beluga. This is more of like a, I guess dark beluga, reverse beluga. But which one would you take? I think the darker one kind of goes a little bit harder. Let me see, get y'all over here view right quick. Nah, they both hard, they both hard. They both hard, they both hard. Okay, I'm happy with both of these, but um, I had to put these closely together because it's two kind of different shoes. The bottom, one's lighter, one's darker. You can't go wrong with having the reverse and the OG. They look really, really good. I see they changed something up a little bit. You got the Yeezy and the Adidas three stripes, whereas you had Adidas and Yeezy on the shoe. Anyway, these look pretty good. Let me see if anything has changed on the inside. I think they took that. They took something off the inside, right? Maybe it was just the insole. Let's check this other shoe right quick. And you know, we getting on up out of here. This orange is vibrant. I mean, on camera, it's really not going to pick up like that. But this orange is very, very vibrant in person. I love the way that looks. These look even harder in person than they do on camera. Anyway, ain't too much to go over. You got this black bottom, whereas you got the gray bottom here. Very nice. And yeah, man, it's a, it's a very nice shoe. I think these are very much needed. These are sneakers that I wear, or the Yeezy 350 is a sneaker I very much wear like all summer long because they're comfortable, they're dope looking, they're wearable. I don't wear them with jeans, only shorts, maybe a few joggers and sweatpants. I think they look absolutely atrocious with jeans. But yeah, man, this is one of my favorite sneakers of all time as far as comfortability. I don't really wear anything else except for something like this uh, around the uh, summer and spring months. Anyway, let me know what you guys think about these. You got the reversed Beluga. Oh, these are hard. Oh, they hard. Or are you taking OG Beluga? Oh, man. I think with me wearing a lot more darker tones, I would probably be grabbing my reverse Belugas. 
but these ain't no slouch i like both of them though but them hard right there anyway let me know what y'all think about this video down below and the reverse beluga versus the regular beluga this is mk the truth d-o-d-b-e-n-t hey man i love y'all guess what i'm out of here